Hey everyone, welcome back to yet another episode of Gen AI Vlog. So recently, NVIDIA has come up with a list of products that's actually competing with the hyperscalers out there. So we're talking about Microsoft, Amazon, Google. Sorry guys, NVIDIA is coming for you, right? It's not just competing on a hardware space, now it's trying to compete on the cloud platform, which is very interesting. So in this video, we're gonna show a small demo of some of the uh, most groundbreaking stuff that we've been seeing from the NVIDIA platform right now. So recall previously, we have ChatGPT, right? We have Anthropic, we have Perplexity AI, Character.AI. We have all these AI products that's based on large language model that you can talk to it like a chatbot. But what if that's still lag behind, right? What if I'm just too lazy? I don't even want to type things down. I want to talk to a person and just have this person talk to me back. So let's see the demo. Hey, how's it going? Hi, I'm James, a digital human. You can ask me about NVIDIA and its products. So I don't really understand the Nemo product. Can you tell me a little bit about it? Nemo is an application framework that helps companies build, customize, and run large language models, LLMs, for their specific industries and languages accelerating generative AI workloads. So what kind of large language model are you guys supporting right now on the platform? We're supporting various large language models, including GPT-3, T5, and biomolecular transformer AI models for applications like AI chatbots, enterprise search engines, market, uh, no, I, um, and market intelligence tools. That's great. Can you tell me a little bit about the pricing? NVIDIA Nemo pricing varies depending on the specific use case and deployment, but it's designed to be cost effective, with some customers seeing a reduction in costs by up to 90% compared to traditional approaches. So there you go, guys. Look, based on this demo that you guys just see, NVIDIA is out of this world, right? It's pushing the boundary of artificial intelligence just, you know, two, three steps ahead. And and from concept of this demo, I think OpenAI and Thropic, you guys better catch up. You guys are kind of lacking behind right now. So with that being said, just want to share that video with the audience, with the community. Thank you for watching. Subscribe and like.